Hi today from the Caribbean. Today we'll be talking about equality in the third part of our equality series. Today we'll be talking about the equality of rules. See you in the next part. You may have won an impression from my previous videos that I am against equality. Not at all. I am of course in favor of equality, but equality of rules, meaning that everybody should have the same rules should apply to everybody, to the same laws should apply to everybody and everybody should have the same options in his life. I am not in favor of equality in the sense of equaling everybody at the end after they have performed. So the equality of outcomes, which ends up in uh, robbing somebody of the fruits of his work in uh, favor of uh, somebody else who didn't work for that outcome, for that money. But the equality of rules, this is really important in uh, the society. And the greatest uh, injustice that we witness today is the injustice of central banking and uh, of partial banking reserve. That means that there are some people in the system, some institutions, who just create money for free and can buy anything they want for that money, for uh, uh, the money that others have worked for or create value for. Uh, I'm talking here about states, about some state organizations, also about banks. So the uh, money is available for them generally for free or almost for free. They can regenerate, they can roll the debt, whatever. They can um, actually make available for them as much money as they need for anything. And this has a side effect. This devalues the money of the people who actually provide value for others, who actually produce something because you know the money basis grows that way and of course uh, inflation is caused that way and i'm not meaning only the institutions who uh, directly create money or who can create money or who, who can trigger the money creation but also the institutions the people who are close to the printer for example, getting subsidies for free or getting cheap credit because they are close to the printer, because they are big corporation and have, um, let's say, uh, political influence and can influence the government or the governmental institutions uh, generally to make money available for them very cheaply or even for free. So. There are some people who just take advantage of the system and uh, this is to the disadvantage of the people who actually produce value. So as long as some people do nothing, don't create value, but get money just because they are closer to the printer, while others who create money have to work for that money and their money the money they have earned, the value they have created, is devalued by the money creation, by the inflation caused by the others, the parasites. As long as this happens, there is a great injustice in the system. There is no problem with some people being richer and some people being poorer uh, because they have performed better in their lives, because they uh, made better economic decisions because they created more value or less value. There is no problem with that, with people being extremely rich and extremely poor. The problem is in the financial system, where some people get money for free while others have to create value and the value they have created, the money they have got for the value they have created, gets devalued because of the other people uh, getting money for free and creating money out of nowhere at no cost. So as long as this system functions, as long as this system prevails, there will be no social justice can be achieved. Social justice can be achieved only if there is equality of rules. And this is the equality we should strive for. That's it. 
for today from the Caribbean. If you like this video, give me a thumb up. If not, of course, thumb down. I talk here a lot about economy, about money, about doing great impossible things in business. I talk here about how the best entrepreneurs of our times think and act, how our self-made billionaires think and act. So, if you like this video, you also like my other videos, I invite you to watch them. That's it for today from the Caribbean. I wish you a fantastic day. Let's do something extraordinary today.